Hi, my name is Jürgen Etter. I'm the business development manager for Hardware in the Loop Test at National Instruments. To be able to test electronic control units for driver assistance systems in the lab, you need to be able to emulate the environment so that the electronic control unit thinks it's in the car, but it's actually in the lab. So what we're showing here is a test of an electronic control unit for a, a adaptive cruise control. So what you need to do there is to have a drive scenario, which gives you, in this case, the distance to the front car, the, um, the speed, and then these signals are fed back into the control unit from a real-time system, which emulates the physical signal, um, the speed, so that the controller can calculate um, the brake or accelerate uh, signals. In other systems, it's more complicated. You have cameras as well, radar signals, LiDAR signals, ultrasonic. And thinking of autonomous cars, it has to be fused so that the ECU can take decisions. So, if you have similar challenges, talk to us and we help you solve it. Thank you.